Hey, what's happening everybody and welcome back to Dad Play. Today we're back with another Metaverse game guide for play to earn, which seems to be the real hot thing in Decentraland right now with plenty of these things popping up all over the place. Today we're gonna jump in over at number 217 so right around the corner from Genesis Plaza and this is for a brand new game which actually only released on the 7th of July 2022 um, and this one is called Cyber Strife Battle to Earn and basically the idea of this is that you're going to want to go mine some rocks a bit like some other games in Decentraland but then you are going to be using the fuel to move your spacecraft around. Before we get into the actual game itself we'll just have a very quick look at the scene because there are some information down here bits that you can read and then you're gonna go all the way up to the top level which is going to tell you about these different weapons so I'm guessing that the little aliens that we just saw down the bottom are going to become um, creatures that we're going to fight in the future um, but the idea is is that you're going to go and fill up your over here you've got your nitrate so you're going to be you're going to be mining to get your nitrate and then you're so the nitrates here and then you're going to be using your 20 nitrate to convert that into one fuel and then when you do get your fuel you're then going to come up and hit this button here and this is going to move your spaceship towards the end and I think the idea of the game is that you get yourself all the way over to here and this is going to be um, basically what you need to do in order to get this green one here so when you read this it tells you about how you're going to get these other items the only thing that I don't understand though is this here it says this act will be acts will be given to owners uh, it will give, give owners rather a plus one attack bonus in the beta version of B so that's not live yet as far as I can tell but it says here all owners of the CS NFTs will be sent this as a free airdrop but I've got no idea what the CS I mean obviously it's saying cyber strife NFTs will be sent this as a free airdrop so unless they're talking about if you own this one this one and this one then they're gonna send you the green one for free which I don't really understand why you would want it if you've got ones that have got better utility or better attack bonuses you've got plus three attack plus three mining or plus five and so that's obviously the one that you're gonna want um, so yeah I don't really understand it so devs if you could clear that up that would be really useful because I was under the impression that maybe everybody would get this if they were part of like doing this now four axes will be introduced on the 7th of July all owners are sent a DCL axe wearable so, so I'm guessing maybe, let's go down and have a quick look and just see if there's an open sea down here. So we've got Meta Party Discord, Meta Party, Meta Party Discord, Meta Party. Okay, so that's all duplication. And over this side, we've got, oh, okay, so here's the NFTs. So, okay, well, that's not working. So I'm guessing we're going to have to look that up on OpenSea individually. Um, so yeah, okay. But let's get into the game then. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to come over here. You're going to end up end up pressing this um, mine button here. It's all gone a bit laggy. Um, you press it like that. Your pickaxe comes up very similar to another um, style game. Um, and then you're going to pick up this nitrate here. And then again, you're going to mine it again. And when it pops up, you're going to just take this. And we'll keep going because I'll show you what happens. The one thing that I will say to you though is, you this is this is a bit of a strange game. Now whether or not it's intentional or not, I don't know. But if you leave the scene, it resets absolutely everything. So this morning we had a quick go of it just to have a little go and see what it was all about. We'll cover this bit in a moment. Um, and when we came back ready to do the video, um, all of this had reset. So and the spaceship had reset as well. So you've got to do this all in one go. You can't do a little bit and come back later. So devs, you might want to fix that because I think that's going to require people to spend a lot of time here to get to the required amount of fuel. Um, but anyway, so this game is really, really new. I will say it's only been out 24 hours, not even 24 hours. So that it might be something that they've overlooked or they might be coming to fix. Um, so this is here, you've got to add your nitrate to the container. But again, it does this at 5, 10, 15 and 20. But when you go to your container over here and you click it, you can't actually do it. But you've got to do that to unlock this again. So there we go, that's all shut. Um, so you've got to do that and then you can come back to this rock and you can mine it again because it will, it will just lock it and stop you from doing that. So we'll keep going with this for the moment and then I'll show you what happens when you get to the top. It's just a bit annoying because we did have four fuel in the pot ready to show you um, but as I say the whole thing reset which I wasn't expecting. So we'll keep going with this just for now. 
and you'll get there but it really is as simple as literally you click once you wait for the thing to appear then you're gonna have to click that to get rid of it come back over here to unlock the rock again and then go back again so whether or not that's something that the, that the uh, team needs to just fix um, then I'm sure that will be coming in like a, the next update um, but for, for now it's quite a simple straightforward game which I know is, is pretty useful really if all you wanted to do was come in do a bit of work and go but I've got to be honest I think if I've got to stay here and do the entire um, trip of the space rocket which I'll show you in just a second um, if I've got to do that all in one go I probably won't spend the time if I'm honest because I think it's going to take quite a long while I mean we'll see how long this takes us as we're doing the video now and this is just to get one fuel so if you're gonna to need to get 50 of these you're gonna be here I would say at least a few hours to, to get that and, then, and I guess really it depends on how badly you want the pickaxes, um, whether or not this is a, I mean the thing with a lot of these play to earn games is, you can't really, if you want to do really well at them and earn quite a bit out of them, then you kind of need to pick one I think and stick with it. Like for example you wouldn't be able to play um, this as well as Dice Masters, as well as Exodus, as well as loads of other games because you just wouldn't have enough hours in the day um, like to basically to get a, a decent enough level and progression on them unless you literally have nothing else to do other than sit and play play to earn all day um, so anyway this bit here is now for 2020 you come over here and you literally press this and then it says here you need next move needs five fuel so what's happened is this spaceship has gone forward a, a short space here but now we need a hundred nitrate which will convert to five fuel to then get us across into the next area so like I say it's kind of one of those things that it is literally as simple as that and if you do go off of the scene it is going to reset the whole thing so you are going to be doing this for a very long while so if your connection gets interrupted or if you reset refresh by accident at the moment that has been what has been completely wiping the stores so really it's going to be one of those questions of whether or not you think it's worth it for you to put all of your time in it is quite a significant amount of time I think you're going to need if this next move takes five fuel just alone then you know what is it going to be to get up to that finish line it's going to be a lot um, and some of these people were here this morning when I was playing and like it's another two and a half hours later and they're still here so I guess there will be some people putting in the effort required to get all the way to the end um, but that is it it's quite a nice short one today this is really a simple game I would say come over and try it out if you think that this is something that you're going to play and get involved in it doesn't appear that there were any POAPs wearables or any other other items we just got photo bombed there by one of the uh, NPCs so uh, that's always fun but um but yeah come over to like 317 this kind of area if this sounds like your sort of thing and jump in and see what you can earn I hope this has been useful for you today this guide if it has then please do like the video and consider subscribing to our channel we do produce videos very often here we go got photo bombed again um we do produce videos on a regular basis for decentraland and metaverse gaming um and this is a very much a community element so do check us out on twitter at dab play for giveaways nfts wearables all of that sort of fun stuff and if you are in decentraland then make sure towards the end of july and august you're uh, keeping an eye on our twitter and on our youtube channel because over here at 1 30 when you click it it says here that it's an untitled scene and then it refreshes with dab play hq so at the moment there's a big rubber ducky on it and our social handles this will be populated very very soon i promise you with a great big scene and uh, well as big a scene as you can get on one parcel which is what we've bought um but it is going to be a nice big scene and there will be on launch night a poap and several other nft giveaways and hopefully a wearable giveaway away as well providing we can get it all made in time but that's everything from us today hope you've enjoyed the video and we will see you on the next one be safe out there and enjoy the metaverse